Hi, and welcome to the WinCCOA 101. In this video, I will explain to you how you get started quickly and easily with WinCCOA. Let me show you how you get WinCCOA. For that, you just need a simple browser and search for wincoa.com. You will reach the wincoa portal. Just open that. On the wincoa world, you need to register as a user first. To make the registration, you can click on this link. Request your free wincoa evaluation license. After your successful registration to the WinCCOA world, you have to log in again and you can request your evaluation license for free. To get your evaluation license, click the link and follow the steps. Once you have completed them, you will receive an email with your license details, which we will walk through together later in this video. After you did that, download WinCCOA. Let me show you how. Just download the latest WinCCOA version by this link. You will get leaded to the WinCCOA download page. Here you can download the latest WinCCOA version for Windows or for Linux. Just follow the link and download the execution file. Let me show you now how you can install your WinCCOA. Just run the WinCCOA setup executable and you will arrive on this screen. Here you only need to select the directory where WinCCOA will be installed and the directory for the example projects and for your WinCCOA projects. I would suggest keep those defaults and continue with next. On the next dialog, I would suggest you choose all components to get all WinCCOA components installed. After you've selected that, continue with install. After your setup finished completely, you just need to exit. Sometimes Windows is asking for restarting your machine. After you have finalized the steps to request your free trial license, you will receive an email from us that contains license ticket ID, the expire date of your license, and the link to access to the license activation page. There's also a possibility to, to activate a license offline-wise without having internet connection. Today I will show you how you can activate a license with having an internet connection. Click on the link in the email that you get by us. That will bring you to the license activation page. On the home screen, just paste the ticket ID and continue with next. Here, just activate your license. Choose the software license key, get the container automatically and finally activate your license. Your license is now successfully activated. To double check is your license successfully activated you can also start the WinCCOA project administration, the tool what we need to create and administrate projects. And in the icon bar, you can check your license. You can see the software license container number and you can see the license information. 
In my case, I use an evaluation license for one month. In your case, it will be two months. Now I would like to show you how you can create in a very few steps a WinCCOA project. Just click on the icon New Project. Now you will find a list with available project types. To create a project in a very few steps, just pick the second one, Legacy Standard Project, and continue with Next. Now we have to assign the name for the project. On Windows you can use special characters, blanks and spaces for the name and for the path, and on Linux not. I will use the name Basic Training. Now we have to pick the languages for our project. English US is already selected as the default one. For being later able to use multi-language text in our project, you have to pick at least a second language. Languages you can select additionally just by holding the control key. We have to decide the path where our project will be located. I would suggest you the default path WinCC underscore OA underscore approach. This path will be automatically created with the WinCC OA installation. Later you have also the possibility to assign a password for start or stopping your project. At the moment I would suggest to keep that deactivated. Please choose DSQLite as the configuration database and please choose PostgreSQL as the historical database. Continue with Next. Now we can see a summary of all the selections what we did before. Finally, we have to decide the icon theme. You have the choice between a modern icon theme or a classic one. The difference is you get displayed by the info button. Here you can see the modern versus classic version. Finally, to create the project, just say OK. To be able to do later the engineering in our project, there will be a so-called root user account created. You decide if you give the user now a password or later. I would suggest assign the password later. Now finally, we can start the project just by hitting the traffic light icon in the icon bar Start Project. Now the project will start up or the managers start and you will be prompted to enter the root password which is currently empty string so therefore just continue with OK. After you said OK, now we will get the Getty tool and we can start the engineering within WinCC UA. We have seen in this video how to get WinCC UA, how to get your free trial license, how to install and how to create your first WinCC UA project. If you want to learn more about the WinCC UA world, go to wincuacom slash explore and join our community group and follow us on YouTube. Thank you. See you next time.